morning, everybody. Could you all please stand for prayers? I'd like to now call on Miss Alana Dubois to lead us in prayer. We're praying. Father, we are so grateful that we are alive this morning. You have spared our lives throughout the night, and we are here this morning. And for that, our hearts are abundantly grateful. We pray, dear God, for the proceedings of this morning's activity. We pray for every participant, that you will guide them and give them clarity of thought and clarity of speech. We pray, dear God, for this annual trade show. We pray that it will benefit those members of our, of our country. And I pray, dear Father, that every member will continue to benefit from this activity. We thank you for everything that you have done for us, and we continue to look forward to what you will do for us in the future. These are the mercies we ask in your precious name we pray. Amen. Thank you, Ms. Alana Dubois. Do have your seat. <laughs> Mr. Bill Wang, Deputy Chief Mission Counselor of the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan. Mr. Jonathan Yang, Second Secretary of the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan. Mrs. Rufan Philip Carrasco, Marketing Specialist in the Ministry of Commerce, International Trade, Investment, Enterprise Development, and Consumer Affairs. Ms. Shondell Alexander, Entrepreneur of Abbey, Abbey's Exotic Blends. Members of the the exhibitors of the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show and Entrepreneurs, other invited guests, members of the Ministry of Commerce, International Trade, Investment, Enterprise Development, and Consumer Affairs, good morning. Good morning. This is, my name is Stephen Edmund, and I'm your moderator today. It is a great pleasure to uh, launch the, the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. It's the 12th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show, and we're very excited for this year's trade show. I know all our exhibitors are excited. Our friends from Taiwan are very excited, and we are here to tell everyone in St. Lucia, Taiwan, and the rest of the world that this event is happening. At this time, I'd like to call on Miss Lydia Daria. She's a trade show committee member to give the welcome remarks. Please allow me to observe the protocol which has already been established for this press launch and to bid you all a pleasant good morning. On behalf of the Ministry of Commerce, International Trade, Investment, Enterprise Development, and Consumer Affairs, it is indeed a pleasure to warmly welcome you to this press launch to officially unveil this year's 12th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. This highly anticipated trade show forms part of activities in observance of St. Lucia Business Month being held throughout the month of November under the theme, All In, Our Journey, Our Future, Propelling Growth Through Entrepreneurship. The essence of this theme calls for renewed partnerships among the public and private sector to enable the growth of our economy by cultivating a strong, sustainable entrepreneurial culture among the citizenry. This long-standing trade show in a, is an example of such partnerships which exist in support of the government's wider economic development efforts. The annual trade show has therefore been built over the years as a result of the strong and committed bond between the two sister nations of St. Lucia and the Republic of China, Taiwan, which is strengthened year after year. We are therefore pleased to welcome Mr. Bill Wong, Deputy Chief of Mission, and Mr. Jonathan Yang, Second Secretary of the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan, and to thank them for joining us for this unveiling. Your presence is further testimony of the commitment of the government of Taiwan in ensuring that St. Lucia continues to host this prestigious event as part of our efforts to grow our economy through enterprise development in anticipation of increasing our, our participation in global trade. <coughs> this support being provided by the government of the Republic of China, Taiwan, to enable our micro, small, and medium-sized enterprises to gain domestic market presence 
and enter partnerships with hoteliers and distributors island-wide has indeed been achieving its intended objectives and yielding great dividends for our entrepreneurs. We have several success stories of exhibitors having entered into contracts with hoteliers and distributors to supply them with quality goods and services which emerged out of their participation in the annual trade show. Having said this, please permit me to use this opportunity to acknowledge and congratulate Ms. Shondell Alexander of Abbey's Exotic Blends Limited, who captured the Small Business of the Year Award at the recently concluded St. Lucia Business Award Ceremony. Mr. Alexander is a long pa long-standing participant of the trade show, and with each passing year, her product only improves and her market presence spreads far and wide throughout St. Lucia. This, ladies and gentlemen, is what your participation in the St. Lucia Taiwan Trade Show does for your business. It, pit, it puts you a, a cut above the rest and drives your business forward. For this, we, the government and people of St. Lucia, express our heartfelt thanks and appreciation to you, our family and friends of the Republic of China Taiwan, for your continued commitment to developing our economy. In closing, I wish to thank each and every one of you for joining the Ministry of Commerce and the Embassy of the Republic of China Taiwan for this press launch. Let's continue working together to ensure that this trade show is indeed a phenomenal success and one worth emulation by others. Enjoy the rest of this morning's proceedings. I thank you. Thank you very much, Ms. Lydia Daria. At this time, I'd like to call on the marketing specialist in the Ministry of Commerce, Mrs. Mrs. Ruthan Carrasco Phillip, to give a few remarks. The Ministry of Commerce, International Trade, Investment, Enterprise Development, and Consumer Affairs, in partnership with the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan, will once again host its annual St. Lucia Taiwan Trade Show. The focus for this year's trade show is family. When you think of family, do not only think of your immediate family, but think of your extended family, friends, friend or friends. This grand event will be held at the Golden Palm Event Center, Rodney Heights, from Friday, November 29th to Sunday, December 1st, 2019, from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily. The 12th edition of this trade show provides an avenue to showcase a wide range of quality, authentic goods and distinctive services, giving the general public and the business community an opportunity to experience the best, I mean the very best, of St. Lucia and the Republic of China, Taiwan. This trade show would allow for the general public to provide feedback to the artisans on their goods and services. Importantly, Businesses from both countries profit from the opportunity to develop strategic trading and networking alliances to promote their goods and services in the globalized market. The Taiwanese contingent is once again interested in seeking agents for the retail of their products. We are confident that this can be achieved at a separate exclusive event that we are hosting on the November 28th, 2019. We are extremely pleased to have eight great companies from Taiwan participating in the trade show this year. Just to name a few because I can't pronounce all the names, so I'm just mentioning a few. Mr. Bill Wong will mention the rest. Amb Ambition Worldwide Co., Arts Tech Industrial Company Limited, Megalink Technology Company Limited, Spa Food Machinery Company Limited. We are also pleased to have a mix of 45 creative entrepreneurs displaying the exquisite products and services at this year's trade show. The businesses that are participating are, I will mention every one of them because I do not want to miss anyone. Shirley's Creations, Promotions Plus, Dr. Augustine Isaac Art Creation, Trinkets, Viola's Interior Designs, Natural Talents, Poetry Kisses, Illuminating Designs, Silhouette Bijou by Cecilia, Artfell Gifts 758, RNA Design, Caribbean Design Co. Limited, Fetish, Cloakies Craft, Christy Creations, Popular Handmade, St. Lucia Fashion Council, Lee Sweet Treats, Mrs. St. Rose Creole Delights, Abby's Exotic Blends Limited, 
Golden Crown Fast Foods, Inc., Fun Food St. Lucia, Two Scoops, SEA Wines, Make It Chocolate Network, Inc., Regular Spice, Gattas, Caribbean Grains Limited, Vels Multi Services, Baker's Association of St. Lucia, We Fix It, Heritage Charles St. Lucia, Inc., Propagation, Real 3D Printing, Region Designs, Naji, Dread Service, Block and Daring, Healthy Strands, Francis Rub, Saturday's Dream, Farm Essence, Caribbean Handcrafted Soaps, Love and Spice, and Philo St. Lucia. So, why should you attend this year's trade show? Let me tell you why. Limited edition products, special discounts, the best still pan music ever, Christmas karaoke, sing with your family and friends and win a special prize. Zumba Fitness, an opportunity to win gift vouchers. We also have the golden voucher, which you'll know a bit more at the, about at the trade show. A surprise event on Sunday, December 1st from 6 p.m. You, you should be there and lots more. At this point, I wish to thank the trade show committee. I mean, I'm not doing the vote of thanks, but I have to thank key persons right now. I wish to thank them for their dedication and commitment in, in ensuring that the trade show is a success. I also wish to thank Jonathan Yang. Jonathan, can you stand, please? It has been such a tremendous pleasure working with you, and I thank you. Special thanks to the artisans for participating in this year's trade show. Keep creating. We encourage the general public to be part of this wonderful experience. There will be something for everyone. So I encourage you. Attend, support a friend, a family, or make new friends. Network. We aim to make this a wonderful experience for all. And I would also like you to visit the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show for more information. So it's stlucia.taiwan.org. Thank you very much and have a pleasant morning. Thank you very much, Mrs. Ruthan Carrasco Phillip. At this time, I'd like to call on Mr. Bill Wong, the counselor of the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan. Bonjour. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, and all the nice people in front of the TV. Sagafet. <laughs> well, they did not prepare a speech for me, so I just uh, uh, talk about whatever comes to my mind. And don't worry, I won't dance here because this space <laughs> is too, too limited. Uh, this is the 12th year of the trade show. And actually, you know, last year it was the first time for me. And I was deeply touched because, uh, first of all, this is uh, the one and only, not to mention the biggest trade show that, you know, organized by Taiwan with our diplomatic ally countries in this region. And so it allows us an opportunity to feature what is best from Taiwan and what is best from St. Lucia, too. And secondly, I want to emphasize that this is not only a trade show. It is a partnership trade show. That means we come here not just for business, for partnership, because there is really a lot that Taiwan and the Taiwanese businessmen can offer. They came here not just to sell products to you, but they come here to offer you the best solution, either to your needs at home or maybe your industrial needs. So we try to focus on the word partnership because it is a chance for business people from uh, both countries to do some business matching and form some partnership. And one, one, one of these days, I hope that you know, in Taiwan, people are going to enjoy you know, your, your hot sauces because it's so good. We cannot wait to sell it to Taiwan. So it's a partnership and it's both way. So we try to keep it that way and we try to make it even bigger. And by working together, I think we can accomplish great business together. So best of luck to uh, uh, the coming trade show. And I want to especially on behalf of His Excellency Ambassador Dr. Shen, thank the St. Lucian team for working with us, us because our team is very small. But only by working with you can we make it a big business. So thank you very much. 
Messy up here. Thank you so much, Councillor Bill Wong. I like your Creole. <laughs> it's excellent. At this time, I'd like to call Miss Shondell Alexander, entrepreneur of Abbey's Exotic Blend. Exotic Blend. Good morning, everyone. I would like to adopt the protocol already established. I do not have a written speech. I just want to say thank you to everyone of you, the Ministry of Commerce, SEDU, and everyone else who made my journey possible. My dream came through because of the Ministry of Commerce. Um, Mr. Jonathan Allen, he was one of the people really behind me pushing so that I could get to where I'm at today. Um, I was able to secure the leadership excellence in customer service and also implementation of standards and best practices awards last year and this year we got small business of the year um i think all of this came because of the ministry of commerce and also the manufacturers association so those of you young people out there who are um young business people or thinking I think you should join the Manufacturers Association or visit the Commerce or um, SEDU and they will assist you to get to where you want to be. Okay? Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Ms. Shondell Alexander of Abbey's Exotic Blends. At this time, we shall now have a question and answer session for our panelists. So any person in the audience who would like to, could you ask a question? Um, OK, we have a question. Abby, I feel proud of you, of what you get through. I watched you last night. And you said a few, uh, we can join the association with small business. It is very true. Because I'm one last year. I got an award for my business, small business. It's very true to go to Ministry of Commerce also deeper to to join it is very important that's something it is important for us to do our business register our business the right way do everything it's very important and I'm telling you from Sunday I'll be out of St. Lucia to Dominica because of deeper they push me out so that I can get my Frances rub out of St. Lucia and I'm telling you the Taiwanese trade show has lifted me up Ministry of Commerce has lifted me up deeper and all, all the others has lifted me up, and I feel proud of it. And the others at the back, you all need to listen to what Abby said. Push yourself in front, and it's very good. Any other questions? Any other questions? Okay, so, ladies and gentlemen, since we have no further questions, and I must say that was... Uh, the start to our next section, section which is the experience by our exhibitors uh, participating in the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. At this time, I'd like to call um, a representative of Caribbean Grains Limited to share the experience with you. As per, as per established protocol, again, I'd like to say good morning to everyone. And um, the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show have been an amazing experience, an experience that allows for um, good linkage between industries and between the um, different businesses. For Caribbean Greens in particular, it have allowed, um, it have allowed this organization to fully understand its role or its purpose in this industry. Whilst we are a manufacturer of flour, but we are more so a service provider, and our, our ultimate goal is more or less to strengthen the baking industry in St. Lucia and throughout the, the region, and more so what we have done through, again, the most recently held trade show is to create greater awareness of our brand and also to 
help to reorganize or re-energize the Bakers Association in St. Lucia. So I know at the, that for the past two years that um, attendees or patrons have been excited and always jump to that display of bread pastry. So we want to encourage everybody to come for an exciting moment. It may not be through um, the um, Caribbean Greens directly, but the Bakers Association want to display what is made in St. Lucia. Baguette, pastry, not imported, but it's actually made here. So again, the trade show creates linkages, as I said, and it allows that platform or that it helps to build that foundation for businesses to grow into whatever you want to grow into. Thank you. Thank you, sir. This was a representative, representative of Caribbean Grains Limited. At this time, I'd like to call on a representative from Illuminating Designs. As per protocol already established, good morning to everyone. My name is Terrell Nicholas, and I am the owner of Illuminating Designs. As per the trade show, I have participated in it for the past three years, and I can say that it is one of the events that I absolutely look forward to every single year. The opportunity to be part of the trade show has given me an, uh, a chance to be more creative in that I have not just created stuff, but I keep creating different things over the years. And it's an opportunity for you to come out and see what Illuminating Designs has to offer this year in the Senusha Taiwan trade show. I thank you very much. All right. Any other person would like, thank you so much for uh, our representative from Illuminating Designs. And as you could hear, the, they are so excited and have had really good experiences working with the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. And I can tell you my experience there, it's always a wonderful time there. It's a great pleasure to be part of this exhibition. Ladies and gentlemen, anybody else would like to give a few remarks? Okay, we're shy today. And that's, oh, Abby, have some more things to say. Wonderful. I am sorry, I, the purpose I was really here for um, <laughs> I have, currently I have 63 outlets that I supply. 95% of those people that I supply came from this trade show. Every year I get three, four, or five new clients, big business, and it came from this trade show. So those of you, I've been here for six years, this is my sixth year, and it has been wonderful. I look forward to it every year. I, I come up with a new product every year or two so that I can shine at every trade show. That's it. Thank you again, Abby. Uh, there you have it, some excellent testimonies from the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. And I know that all the other exhibitors are excited to show you what they will be having on display at the exhibition. And ladies and gentlemen, I know you're in for a excellent treat. Also our partners from Taiwan, they definitely will be here. And we have eight companies as our marketing specialists. Uh, Ms. Rufan Carrasco Philip told us that they will be here to show off their products and services from Taiwan. So ladies and gentlemen, we need to take part in the St. Lucia Taiwan exhibition. Um, we would now uh, like to tell the public that we will be having giveaways. So right now you could uh, log into our live platform, which is on the Government of St. Lucia Facebook uh, website, on Facebook, Government of St. Lucia on Facebook. And we have three questions and you could win yourself $40 vouchers, which you could use at the trade show from November 29th to December 1st. That's 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily at the Golden Palm Center that's in Rodney Bay. The first question, how many St. Lucian businesses are taking part in this year's trade show? Again, how many businesses 
how many St. Lucian businesses, sorry, are taking part in this year's trade show? Second question, how many years has the trade show been in existence? How many years has the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show been in existence? And the third question is when and where will this year's trade show be held? So ladies and gentlemen, go on to the Facebook and let us know your answers and you get a chance to win a $40 voucher which you could use to purchase any item at the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. All right, so at this time, I'd like to call on Ms. Franny Monrose, to, a trade show committee member, to deliver the closing remarks and vote of thanks. <clears throat> With protocol having been established, I bid you all a pleasant good morning. Thank you for the time taken to join the Ministry of Commerce international trade, investment, enterprise development and consumer affairs, and the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan, for this press launch on the heels of the 12th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. Given the tremendous support the government and people of the Republic of China, Taiwan, continue to provide year after year to ensure that we have a trade show, we need to express our heartfelt thanks and appreciation to you, our family and friends of the Republic of China, Taiwan, for your unwavering support. Drawing even closer to home, the Ministry would like to acknowledge and thank Mr. Bill Wong, Deputy Chief of Mission, and Mr. Jonathan Yang, Second Secretary of the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan, for their stewardship patience and support thus far towards ensuring that this trade show is one like no other we have had in St. Lucia. We are indeed grateful to have you as part of the team and keeping us on track with executing the plans for the trade show. Permit me also to acknowledge and thank Ms. Shondell Alexander of Abbey's Exotic Blends Limited for your participation in this press launch and for sharing such a rewarding experience with us as a long-standing participant of the trade show. I trust that you have motivated others to join the trade show train in order to take their business to the next level. Of course, we need to also thank our other entrepreneurs who will be participating in this year's trade show for the time taken to join us for this launch. We remain confident that the quality products and services you will be showcasing will exceed the expectations of buyers and help you meet your business objectives. We must also thank the staff of the Ministry of Commerce for your attendance as well as the members of the Trade Show Committee being spearheaded by Mrs. Rufan Carrasco Philip. The Trade Show Committee continues to work above and beyond the call of duty to ensure the delivery of a trade show which surpasses one's expectations by ensuring all the finer details are in place and patrons have a real St. Lucia Taiwan experience when they enter the Golden Palm Event Center. And ladies and gentlemen, if anyone knows Ruthann, you would know she will go all out to ensure all tables are well presented and the red carpet is rolled out. Finally, thank you to the staff of the Government Information Service for accommodating the Ministry and the Embassy for this press launch, and to you, the members of the media, who are always supportive of our efforts. We say thank you and remind you to be part of the opening ceremony on Friday, November 29th to December 3rd. Oh, sorry. We remind you to be part of the opening ceremony on Friday, November 29th at the Golden Palm Events Center. I thank you and enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you very much, Miss Franny Monrose. And we have now reached the end of our press launch. 
Uh, I would like to thank again everyone for being here. It's my pleasure to moderate here today. My name is Stephen Edmund, and I would like to let everyone know that on the outside we have a display of some of the exhibitors that will be taking part in the St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. You are invited to observe, sample, and maybe you could get a special discount from one of the exhibitors. Thank you so much again, and it's a great pleasure. Let me just remind you that the extraordinary experience awaits you as the Ministry of Commerce, International Trade, Investment, Enterprise Development, and Consumer Affairs in partnership with the Embassy of the Republic of China, Taiwan. They bring you the 12th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show to be held at the Golden Palm Conference Center in Rodney Heights, Groselay, from November 29th to, no to December 1st, 2019. It starts from 10 a.m. to 8 p.m. daily and come witness a display of authentic and unique products, goods, and services. Browse, buy, or just sample. Lots of family-oriented activities to experience, including a fashion show, face painting, karaoke competition, and live performances by renowned artists. So, ladies and gentlemen, it is going to be exciting. It is going to be excellent. You need to be at the 12th annual St. Lucia Taiwan Partnership Trade Show. Thank you.